In February 1933, Jenrik Yagoda, head of the secret police, and Mativ Berman, head of the Gulag labor camp, proposed to Stalin a resettlement plan where up to 2 million people were forced into labor settlements in Siberia. The detainees had to populate the land and become self-sustaining collective farms within two years. The new collective farms would solve the famine, while the harsh Siberian weather would punish the prisoners. Due to past success and his confidence in the proposal, Yagoda ordered authorities to round up kulaks, criminals, and other undesirable people before Stalin had approved of the plan. Authorities had to meet quotas, so some imprisoned people were commoners instead of criminals or kulaks. For instance, when a mother left her 12-year-old daughter at a train platform to buy bread, the police abducted her daughter to meet quotas.